Musical Monday. Today is all about instrumental contemporary hits. You may not know every song and that's okay. This is just meant to be a, a soundscape tapestry uh, to go in the background as you're coming home from work or as you're finishing your work day or as you're cooking dinner because I know some of you are cooking dinner at four o'clock because you've told me and that's okay. You can do whatever you want. Next song is Living Hope. We did this in service yesterday. If you know Cindy, Cindy uh, Scheidler, we want to lift her up in prayers today. Um, she's got some, uh, some medical things going on, so if you know about that, please lift her up. And even if you don't, um, just lift Cindy up in prayers. Um, there's a lot of folks um, in the hospital getting surgeries done, having some complications, having COVID. And so um, if you have some unspokens or some other prayer requests, we'd love for you to just hit those in the comments and so people can know what's going on. I also learned that uh, a lot of folks who don't even come to church here watch Musical Monday, and we're thrilled to have you, um, whether you go to other local churches or um, whether you don't live around here at all. We're just thrilled to have you join us. So we're going to do a, a song called Truth I'm Standing On that we featured yesterday in service, um, and that was um, because Julie Mize was so kind to share her story with us, and this is one of the songs that she said she got strength from. So this is Truth I'm Standing On.
take it back to 2010, which I guess wasn't that long ago, and do uh, Our God.
you're still with us, um, a running theme of Musical Monday is you just throw in the comments something you're thankful for. It doesn't have to be Thanksgiving to be thankful, or just list your blessings or something that you're happy about, uh, because it's easy to complain and it's easy to bring others down, but that's not what we're called to do. So please, in the comments, throw in something that's making you happy today or something that you're excited about. This next song is Over All I Know.
Love that song. Hello, all these. song for you guys today. Um, I'm going to do Spirit of the Living God. Um, some of the words have just been coming through my um, mind recently uh, in the chorus. Because when you speak and when you move, when you do what only you can do, it changes us. It changes what we see and what we seek. So if you know the song, you can kind of sing along. This is Spirit of the Living God. Uh, don't forget, by the way, we are only about um, two months out from Easter. Those plans will be coming out soon about um, service times and all that. So please make plans if you don't have plans to attend a church. If you're not already a member, to come see us. There's going to be plenty of room. Um, we're going to do multiple services so everybody can spread out and be safe. So um, just keep that um, in the forefront of your mind. I think Easter is April 4th this year. I'll have to check that, but it's early. Here we go. Spirit of the Living God.
before you head out, uh, there's a big banner hanging above my head that says, bless the rest. So if you could take the time to bless someone tonight, give them a call, someone you haven't talked to in a while, someone you haven't seen at church in a while, uh, a family member, just reach out to somebody and, and find what is something you can do to help somebody tonight. That is the whole spirit of the church and kind of our theme. So as you reflect on that, I'm going to do, um, I'm going to do what a friend we have in Jesus, just because uh, I like that song and it's popped in my head and it's a kid's song and uh, we have a vibrant kids ministry here too, so. Thank you guys. We'll see you uh, next week for Reviews for Monday. Next week is Vanessa Cole and I, so it's going to be great. Mm -hmm.